Welcome to Ameritawa's Kitchen. Today, we're making ube cassava cake using purple yam powder. I am using three fresh cassavas or we call it kamoteng kahoy in the Philippines. Remove the skin. Cut into quarters. Scrape the cassava using the fine part of the box grater. Using the cheesecloth, we will remove the juice of the cassava. Or you can drain it using a sieve. Grease the baking glass and set aside. Now let's pour in the melted butter into the cassava. Add one half can of condensed milk, one can of evaporated milk, one fourth cup of sugar, one half teaspoon of salt. Now let's mix two eggs in a measuring glass. and pour them into the cassava mixture. Let's add the rehydrated purple yam powder to the cassava. Now we'll add the ube extract. Add more until you get the color you like. At this time, let's add half a can of coconut milk. Since I don't have makapuno strings in my area, I use shredded young coconut. Finally, we add the grated cheese and mix. Now let's ladle the ube cassava mixture into our prepared baking glass. For our toppings, beat one egg, and we use the remained one half of the condensed milk, one half of the coconut milk, and mix. Gently pour the topping mixture into the baked ube cassava cake. And here is our ube cassava cake. Here's my favorite part. Let's slice and taste. Honestly, the purple yam powder tastes like the real purple yam or ube. It's sticky and delicious. I hope you guys will try it. Happy cooking! Thank you for watching my video. If you want to see more, please remember to share, like, and subscribe. God bless!